This is Gene Key, KDDD News. Dumas and Moore County may see an increase in traffic through the weekend. ConnectAmarillo.com reports an estimated 30,000 people will flood the hotels, restaurants, and civic center in Amarillo this weekend for the 27th annual Amarillo Farm and Ranch Show. More than 460 exhibitors from five different states, including Texas, Colorado, Kansas, Oklahoma, and New Mexico, lined the inside of the Civic Center for the show. They displayed everything agricultural from large pieces of equipment like tractors and combines to other aspects of the farming business like irrigation equipment, seed companies, and insurance information. The Dumas City Commissioners met for a regular meeting last week. During the meeting, a donation was presented by the Cavern Haunted House to two Dumas organizations. The largest amount of money was given to the Community Assistance Program for $2,080, followed by the Dumas Wrestlers with a $700 donation. Firefighters have rescued a Texas plainsman who proved to be no Santa Claus. The Associated Press reports fire officials say they had to hoist the 22-year-old man by rope from the chimney of his own home in southwest Lubbock early Monday. Deputy Fire Marshal Robert Loveless tells the Lubbock Avalanche Journal that the man had locked himself and his family out of the house about 1 a.m. Monday. Loveless says the man wanting to save the price of a locksmith decided to enter the house through the chimney as his wife and child waited outside. Loveless says the man's wife called 911 after he became stuck. Firefighters hauled him out unhurt about an hour later. If you would like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDDD News.